Hello, I'm Jasveer Singh and in this video, I'm going to give you the sample answer of this uh, essay prompt. Uh, it is a double question essay and uh, my students wrote this essay last week and they struggled uh, with this essay. So that is why I decided to prepare its sample answer and I would like to share this sample answer with you. Well, I will use both languages, English and Punjabi. First, I will try to explain whole essay in English and later on I will explain this essay in Punjabi as well. I will explain you the grammar structures that I used uh, and the vocabulary that I used in this essay. And if you want to see the structure that I recommend for this kind of essay, you can search uh, essay structure on my YouTube channel. So let us start with the essay prompt now. So the essay prompt is exposure to international media such as films, TV and magazines have a significant impact on local cultures. What do you think has been the impact? Do you think its advantages outweigh the disadvantages? So it is a double question essay. One thing they asked, they asked for the impact of international media on the local culture and they asked does this trend have more advantages or more disadvantages so let us see how i wrote the introduction it is true that different kinds of international media has become has become sorry not becoming has become it, it is true that different kinds of international media has become increasingly popular, increasingly what if it has become increasingly popular, uh, it is wrong, has become increasingly popular among people from different cultures and traditions, different countries and cultures. Undoubtedly, this trend has a considerable influence on the local cultures of the countries. While there are some benefits of this trend, I personally feel I personally feel its drawbacks far outweigh these possible benefits. So in the introduction, I rewrite the essay prompt and uh, i gave two i gave the answer of two questions that there are considerable influence uh, on the dash dash and uh, drawbacks are more than its benefits so let us move to the bp1 now so at the outset the most noticeable impact of the rising trend of international media on local cultures is that local cultures are being assimilated with other cultures of other countries. Culture assimilation, you can search on the Google what do you mean by culture assimil assimilation. Uh, uh, culture assimilate means the mixing of the culture. In fact, it is not mixing, it is some sort of one culture is dominating to another culture so this is called culture uh, assimilation so uh, this is my main idea that local cultures are being assimilated with other countries of with the cultures of other countries so let me explain this point now in other words when local people watch international news and movies, read international print media, and listen songs from other countries, comma, they get to know about the cultures of these countries due to, full stop, here is a full stop, and due to the adoptive human nature, they tend to follow the cultures of these countries and they start forgetting about their own local culture. However, it doesn't mean that this impact is always negative. In fact, in some ways, the local customs and traditions are being benefited. 
since some of the unwanted rituals and myths are being wiped out owing to the influence of international media so in this bp i explained that uh, uh, the culture assimilation is the is the major impact you can you can also say culture modification so uh, i'm not sure about culture modification is a right word or not so uh, that means uh, international media has both kind of impacts positive and negative and uh, i just tried to explain both of the impacts so uh, now <coughs> this is about bp1 is about only local cultures what is the impact of uh, international media on the local culture the, and i show that both kind of impacts can be possible in fact i i showed that uh, negative impact is more on the local culture as compared to the do the positive impact uh, and let us move to the uh, bp1 now sorry bp2 so the way i see this trend the growing popularity of foreign media is more disadvantageous in different ways the most considerable disadvantage is the culture assimilation the culture assimilation despite the fact that different cul cultures comma because of exposure to international media have the opportunity to learn learn about one another cultures comma the over exposure and dominance of one culture can take a heavy toll on the local cultures fine so uh, unfortunately how what is the heavy toll unfortunately it has been seen that many indigenous cultures are being extinct due to the dominance of western culture across the world so that means uh, till here i was explaining my point and unfortunately then i explained my main point that was uh, international media is taking a heavy toll means to uh, destroying the local media uh, local culture so uh, unfortunately this is my further support to my idea unfortunately it has been seen that many indigenous cultures are being extinct due to the dominance of western culture across the world so what is the next point now here is the next point another drawback of this trend is is on is on is on the local economy if an increasing number of people start taking their keen interest in the foreign media the the local media may not be survive in its local market this does not only impact the employment rate of the local country but this also adversely impacts the the local tradition and businesses local traditional businesses sorry uh, it this also adversely impacts the local traditional businesses so this is how i explain the drawbacks of uh, uh, growing popularity of international media and the one factor is cultural culture assimilation mixing of cultures uh, and uh, extinction of some cultures and the second point is on the economy so uh, let us move to the conclusion now in conclusion although the growing trend of the the, the growing popularity of the international media can have both positive and negative impacts on the local countries i personally believe on the local cultures Uh, i personally believe that this trend brings more drawbacks than its possible benefits okay so this is my whole essay i hope uh, you learned something good from this essay and uh, there is not any right or wrong way to write uh, an essay this is this is just my way of writing and uh, this is the way i present ideas so you can read it you can uh, if you think it is good you can modify it so you can modify your own essays so now uh, i will explain everything in punjabi so that you can get the point exactly okay so pehla pa gal karde hai ga 
ਮੈਂ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਪੜ੍ਹ ਕੇ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਸਾਰਾ ਸੁਣਾ ਦਿੰਦਾ ਹੈਗਾ ਹੈ ਇਟ ਇਜ਼ ਟਰੂ ਦੈਟ ਡਿਫਰੈਂਟ ਕਾਈਂਡਸ ਆਫ ਇੰਟਰਨੈਸ਼ਨਲ ਮੀਡੀਆ ਹੈਜ਼ ਬਿਕਮ ਇਨਕਰੀਜ਼ਿੰਗਲੀ ਪਪੂਲਰ ਅਮੰਗ ਪੀਪਲ ਫਰਮ ਡਿਫਰੈਂਟ ਕਲਚਰਸ ਐਂਡ ਕੰਟਰੀਜ਼ ਸੋ ਇਹ ਵਿੱਚ ਕੋਈ ਸ਼ੱਕ ਨਹੀਂ ਹੈਗਾ ਕਿ ਇੰਟਰਨੈਸ਼ਨਲ ਮੀਡੀਆ ਬਹੁਤ ਜ਼ਿਆਦਾ ਪਪੂਲਰ ਬਣ ਚੁੱਕਾ ਹੈ ਡਿਫਰੈਂਟ ਕੰਟਰੀਜ਼ ਵਿੱਚ ਡਿਫਰੈਂਟ ਕਲਚਰਸ ਵਿੱਚ undoubtedly this trend has considerable influence on the local culture it's koi shak nahi hai ga ki considerable influence eh bahut achhi wo keh wa considerable influence considerable hunda jinu pa consider kar sake considerable influence ki jinu note kar sake so uh, undoubtedly this trend has a considerable influence on the local culture of the country then while there are ਜਦੋਂ ਕਿ ਇਹਦੇ ਇਹਦੇ ਕੁਝ ਬੈਨੀਫਿਟਸ ਹੈਗੇ ਆ ਆਈ ਪਰਸਨਲੀ ਫੀਲ ਇਹਦੇ ਜਿਹੜੇ ਡਰਾਬੈਕਸ ਆ ਉਹ ਜ਼ਿਆਦਾ ਹੈਗੇ ਆ ਫਾਈਨ ਸੋ ਥਿਸ ਇਜ਼ ਅ ਕੰਪਲੈਕਸ ਸੈਂਟੈਂਸ ਜਦੋਂ ਆਪਾਂ ਵਾਇਲ ਨਾਲ ਸੈਂਟੈਂਸ ਬਣਾਉਣੇ ਤਾਂ ਕੰਪਲੈਕਸ ਸੈਂਟੈਂਸ ਬਣਦਾ ਹੈਗਾ ਸੋ ਇਨ ਦਾ ਇੰਟਰੋਡਕਸ਼ਨ ਕੰਪਲੈਕਸ ਸੈਂਟੈਂਸ ਵੀ ਆ ਗਿਆ ਅੱਛੀ ਵੋਕੈਬ ਵੀ ਆ ਗਈ ਹੈਗੀ ਸੋ ਲੈਟ ਅਸ ਮੂਵ ਟੂ ਦਾ BP1 ਨਾਓ सो so, BP1 ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਕੀ ਲਿਖਿਆ ਹੈਗਾ ਪਹਿਲਾ ਟੌਪਿਕ ਸੈਂਟੈਂਸ ਦਾ ਮੇਨ ਪੁਆਇੰਟ ਨੂੰ ਪ੍ਰੈਜ਼ੈਂਟ ਕਰਨ ਦੀ ਕੋਸ਼ਿਸ਼ ਕਰੀ ਹੈ ਦ ਮੋਸਟ ਨੋਟਿਸੇਬਲ ਇੰਪੈਕਟ ਆਫ ਦ ਰਾਈਜ਼ਿੰਗ ਟ੍ਰੈਂਡ ਆਫ ਇੰਟਰਨੈਸ਼ਨਲ ਮੀਡੀਆ ਔਨ ਦ ਲੋਕਲ ਕਲਚਰ ਇਜ਼ ਥੈਟ ਸੋ ਮੇਨ ਪੁਆਇੰਟ ਨੂੰ ਪ੍ਰੈਜ਼ੈਂਟ ਕਰਨ ਦੀ ਕੋਸ਼ਿਸ਼ ਕਰੀ ਹੈ ਸੋ ਦ ਮੋਸਟ ਪਲੌਜੀਬਲ ਇੰਪੈਕਟ ਆਫ ਰਾਈਜ਼ਿੰਗ ਟ੍ਰੈਂਡ ਆਫ ਇੰਟਰਨੈਸ਼ਨਲ ਮੀਡੀਆ ਔਨ ਲੋਕਲ ਲੋਕਲ ਕਲਚਰ ਮੇਨ ਨੋਟਿਸੇਬਲ ਪੁਆਇੰਟ ਕੀ ਹੈਗਾ ਲੋਕਲ ਕਲਚਰਸ ਆਰ ਬੀਇੰਗ ਐਸਲਮੇਟਡ ਜੋ ਲੋਕਲ ਕਲਚਰ ਨੇ ਉਹ ਮਿਕਸ ਹੋ ਰਹੇ ਹਨ ਮੋਡੀਫਾਈ ਹੋ ਰਹੇ ਨੇ ਵਿਦ ਅਦਰ ਕਲਚਰਸ ਆਫ ਅਦਰ ਕੰਟਰੀਜ਼ ਇਨ ਅਦਰ ਵਰਡਸ ਇਹਦਾ ਮਤਲਬ ਹੈ ਜਦੋਂ ਲੋਕ ਵੈਨ ਵੈਨ ਲੋਕਲ ਪੀਪਲ ਵਾਚ ਇੰਟਰਨੈਸ਼ਨਲ ਨਿਊਜ਼ ਜਦੋਂ ਲੋਕ ਲੋਕਲ ਪੀਪਲ ਇੰਟਰਨੈਸ਼ਨਲ ਨਿਊਜ਼ ਦੇਖਦੇ ਆ ਜਾਂ ਨਿਊਜ਼ਪੇਪਰ ਪੜ੍ਹਦੇ ਹੈਗੇ ਆ ਜਾਂ ਫਿਰ ਸੌਂਗ ਸੁਣਦੇ ਹੈਗੇ ਆ ਤਾਂ ਉਸ ਨਾਲ ਕੀ ਹੁੰਦਾ ਹੈਗਾ they get to know about the cultures of these countries ta unna nu dooje country de cultures bare pata lagda due to the adaptive human nature lokan de jehde human ki adopt kar lenda cheezan due to the adaptive human nature they tend to oh koshish karde a follow the cultures of these countries and start forgetting about their own local culture forgetting apne local culture nu bhulna start kar dende a however par it doesn't mean that this impact is always negative par eta matlab eh nahi hai ga ki ek eh jada impact hamesha negative hi hoga in fact in some ways in fact balike kujh tarike de naal local custom uh, customs and traditions are being benefited te kujh tarike de naal ohna nu benefit ho reha local cultures nu uh, since kyon since hunda because jithe pa because laga sakde ha utthe since laga sakde ha some of the unwanted rituals unwanted rituals rituals ho jande riti rivaj so unwanted rituals and myths myths hunde ne kahavta are being wiped out wiped out bahar kadiyan ja rahiyan ne owing to the influence of international media international media de influence nu dekhde hoye clear so this is how we can write bp1 now bp2 the way i see this trend the growing popularity of foreign media is more disadvantageous in different ways ki jive main is trend nu dekhda that is growing popularity ya international media di oh ohde drawbacks jyada ne the most considerable disadvantage is that considerable fear mein word use kare apa major bhi use kar sakde si the most obvious bhi kar sakde si the most obvious disadvantage is that is the culture assimilation ਉਥੇ ਐਸਲਿਮੇਟਡ ਮੈਂ ਐਜ਼ ਅ ਵਰਮ ਵਰ ਫਾਰਮ ਚ ਯੂਜ਼ ਕਰਿਆ ਸੀ ਇੱਥੇ ਉਹਦੀ ਵਰ ਫਾਰਮ ਚੇਂਜ ਕਰਤੀ ਐਸਮਿਲੇਸ਼ਨ ਨਾਊਨ ਬਣਾਤਾ ਇਹ ਚੀਜ਼ਾਂ ਲੈਕਸੀਕਲ ਰਿਸੋਰਸ ਵਿੱਚ ਆਉਂਦੀਆਂ ਨੇ ਇੱਕ ਵਰਡ ਨੂੰ ਡਿਫਰੈਂਟ ਵਰਡ ਫਾਰਮ ਚ ਯੂਜ਼ ਕਰਨਾ ਇਹ ਤੁਹਾਡੀ ਰੇਂਜ ਨੂੰ ਸ਼ੋ ਕਰਦਾ ਹੈਗਾ ਸੋ ਡਿਸਪਾਈਟ ਦਾ ਫੈਕਟ ਦੈਟ ਡਿਫਰੈਂਟ ਕਲਚਰਸ ਕਿ ਡਿਸਪਾਈਟ ਦਾ ਫੈਕਟ ਕਿ ਚਾਹੇ ਡਿਫਰੈਂਟ ਕਲਚਰਸ ਡਿਸਪਾਈਟ ਦਾ ਫੈਕਟ ਦੈਟ ਡਿਫਰੈਂਟ ਕਲਚਰਸ ਬਿਕਾਜ਼ ਆਫ ਐਕਸਪੋਜ਼ਰ ਆਫ ਇੰਟਰਨੈਸ਼ਨਲ ਮੀਡੀਆ have the opportunity to learn about the another culture ki pa is de bawajood ki uh, international media de contact vich aun de bawajood
जे ओवर एक्सपोजर हो गया बहुत ज़्यादा एक्सपोज हो गया तो डोमीनेस हो गया किसी एक कल्चर की वो की होगा टेक अ हैवी टोल एक अच्छा यानी कि फ्रेज है टेक अ हैवी टोल मतलब ये नैगटिव इंपैक्ट्स हो सकते हैं लोगल कल्चर से बहुत ज़्यादा नैगटिव इंपैक्ट्स हो सकते हैं लोगल कल्चर से अनडाउट अनफॉर्चुनेटली इनफॉर्चुनेटली माड़ी किस्म देखा जा रहा है इट इ देख देखा जा चुका है इट हैज़ बीन सीन दैट मैनी इंडिजनस कल्चर आर बींग एक्सटिंक्ट कि बहुत सारे जो इंडिजनस कल्चर जो एक्सटिंक्ट हो रहे हैं ड्यू टू द डोमीनस ऑफ वैसटर्न कल्चर अक्रॉस द वर्ल्ड सो अनदर ड्रॉबैक ऑफ दिस ट्रेंड इज डोमीनस एक एक चीज़ का जोड़ा प्रभाव बहुत ज़्यादा है अनदर ड्रॉबैक ऑफ दिस ट्रेंड इज होर की ड्रॉबैक हैगी इस ट्रेंड की द इज ऑन द लोकल इकोनमी जी लोकल इकोनमी है वो वो भी खतरे जा सकती है किमें हाउ इफ एन इनक्रीजिंग नंबर ऑफ पीपल स्टार्ट टेकिंग देयर कीन इंटरस्ट इन द फॉरन मीडिया जो फॉरन मीडिया में लोगों का इंटरस्ट बढ़ जाता है द द लोकल मीडिया मे नॉट बी सरवाइव इन इट्स लोकल मार्केट तो जो लोकल मी मीडिया है लो, जोड़ा लोकल मीडिया है वह लोकल मार्केट सरवाइव नहीं कर पाऊगा दिस डज नॉट ओनली इंपैक्ट द इंपलॉयमेंट रेट ऑफ द लोकल कंट्री इंपलॉयमेंट रेट से ही नहीं फर्क पाऊगा बट दिस आल्सो एडवर्सली इंपैक्ट्स द लोकल ट्रडिशनल बिजनेस तो बिजनेस से भी फर्क पेगा इंपलॉयमेंट से भी फर्क पेगा यह कोई ज़्यादा वजिया लाइन नहीं पुटअप हुई इतने होर भी अच्छा आप पा सकते सोच सोच सकते हो इस तो वजी लाइन भी इन कंकलूजन ऑल दो द ग्रोइंग पॉपुलैरिटी ऑफ इंटरैशनल मीडिया कैन हैव बोथ पॉजिटिव एंड नैगटिव इंपैक्ट्स ऑन लोकल कल्चर दोनों पॉजिटिव नैगटिव इंपैक्ट्स हो सकते हैं आई परसनली बिलीव दैट दिस ट्रेंड ब्रिंग्स मोर ड्रॉबैक्स दैन इट्स पॉसीबल बेनीफिट्स तो मैं फिर क्लीयरली करता कि यदि ड्रॉबैक्स ज़्यादा ने एज कंपेयर टू अस ओवरऑल पा के भी गल कर सकते ठीक है जी सो दिस इज़ हाउ वी कैन राइट दिस ऐसे जो इस इंपोर्टेंट वोकैबलरी है तो उसी नोट डाउन करके मीनिंग गूगल तो सर्च कर सकते हो अदरवाइज यू कैन आस्क मी इन द कॉमेंट बॉक्स बिलो ओके थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर वॉचिंग